Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can tell by the title of this video, this is another favourites video. Now I did one of these, it was like two or three months ago by the time that this video goes up, but I'll link the two that I have done previously down below so that if you guys do enjoy this one, then you can go and binge watch them. If you guys are new to my channel, I don't do like monthly favourites yet, just because I don't have um, the means to be able to go out and buy and try a whole lot of different things. Yeah, I've got quite a big list here of things that I have been loving recently, so I thought that I would share them with you guys. So without further ado, let's jump into my favourites. Okay, let's start with clothing. So my first item of clothing that I have really, really been loving recently is this jumper here. So this jumper is basically just like a really, really dark grey jumper. It's really like baggy and slouchy. Um, jumper I did purchase oversized um, so as you guys know that I really really like my jumpers to be oversized They're just the sleeves are quite thick and then they just come into this like little skinny bit on the end this I actually got from Kmart and then the inside is this like woolen material thing and it's so nice and so warm and it's just really really nice and comfy and I pretty much wear this to death Okay, so the last item of clothing that I have been loving is this top here. So this is just a grey baggy long t-shirt thing. It's got like this v-neck and I picked this one up from an op shop and again I wear this t-shirt to death. Okay, the next category is beauty and for this one I just have one. A beauty product that I have been loving currently is the Rockstar Soap from Lush. Now I didn't want to get it out of my shower and for it to be dropping wet. But basically it's just this like wear pink soap. I picked it up in my Auckland haul so I will link it down below. So if you guys want to see a more in depth uh, description of it then you can go and watch that. I've just got the little wrapping bit here so I'll just read that out what it says. So it said inspired by seaside holidays and English candy shops. This soap contains fair trade vanilla absolute to leave you feeling sweetly comforted. So yeah, it's a very, very sweet scent. Um, it smells of vanilla, pink, but when you are in the shower and you wash yourself with it, it doesn't stay pink. It works very, very well in combination with the comforter. So if you put those two things together, you're gonna smell amazing. If you really, really like sweet scents, if you're looking for a soap or even just something to treat yourself, then pick up the Rockstar Soap from Lush. Okay, now on to makeup, and for that I have two. So the two makeup items that I have been loving currently are these two here. So this is the Maybelline Superstay 14 hour lipstick in the shade 085 Tall Mauve Do Us Part. And I use this in combination with this, and this is the designer brand's Lavish Lip Gloss in the shade 603 Mystic Pink. I have it on today. Uh, it's just like a nudie pink colour. Uh, the stick doesn't have a lot of shimmer to it on its own, but when you put the lip gloss on top, it sort of just makes it a bit more glossy. These two are awesome together, and they're pretty much a colour match as well. So, okay, so the next thing I have been loving is a website, and it is called whatshouldireadnext.com. I'll put it on the screen. So basically, I found this website through Pinterest, and basically what you do is you type in a book that you really really enjoy and you push like enter or whatever it is and then it gives you a selection of books that is similar to that one but it comes up with like a good selection. It said on Pinterest about 10 to it comes up with about 20. Um, this video isn't sponsored or anything but it's just a really really good website so if you're after something new to read uh, please go and check out that website. Okay, the next category I'm going to do is apps, and so the app that I have been really, really loving at the moment is Pinterest. Um, my Pinterest is Paige Christison. I will leave it in the description box below, so please go and follow me over on that. Pinterest, you basically just, if you don't know, which I'm sure everyone does, but if you don't know, basically you just look up pictures and you pin them to various boards. found a lot of really, really cool things through Pinterest. This has a mix of everything on there as well, and you can also like message your mates um, you can send them like memes and just talk to them on Pinterest as well, which is really, really cool. Okay, so the next category I'm going to do are games, and there are two games in particular that I have been loving. So I have been really, really obsessed with card games lately. So card games such as Uno and Scum. 
Now I was playing scum at sports camp with a whole lot of people and it was the best game of scum that I have ever played and it just got really really competitive. Um, everyone was so enthusiastic. We were playing this late at night and we were laughing so much. And they're also really good because they get your friends and yourself off your phones. Just something about playing cards or like playing board games and stuff. It's just really really nice. Okay, the next category is books and I have two. So the first book that I have really, really been obsessed with is Every Day by David Levithan. So basically it just follows the story of this being called A and A inhabits human bodies. He's not bad, like he's not out to kill you or anything. He's just kind of like, not a person, but like something living as a person. Each body he inhabits changes each day so one day he can be like a girl the next day a boy the next day an athlete the next day someone who's maybe a little bit on the bigger side and he falls for this girl called Rhiannon normally can't remember what you experienced the day before unless you write it down but somehow Rhiannon sticks through A's mind and then A tries to contact Rhiannon and it just sort of follows them and their story the way it's written, it's really, really good. It gets into the action really, really fast, so you don't have to be kept waiting. And it's just one of those books that you'll want to continuously read and not put down. David Levithan is an amazing, amazing author. So yeah, please go and check out this book if you have not read it already. And the last book I have currently been loving is this book here. This is Every Breath by Ali Mani. And basically it just follows the story of two friends called Rachel Watts and James Mycroft. And they find out that their friend got murdered. And James Mycroft is really like into forensics and stuff. So he tries to solve the murder with um, this girl called Rachel who he's been friends with for like childhood. It follows their journey or adventure I guess on trying to solve this murder. I just get like an insight into their friendship as well. And this is part of a trilogy and I have the next book up there. The next book is called Every Word and I think the last book is called Every Move. Really, really good and again it gets into the action quite fast and quite fast paced throughout the book. So yeah, if you're looking for like a new murder, mystery, drama with like some friendship, then go check this one out because you'll thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy this. Okay, so the next category I'm going to do is food. First food item I have been currently obsessed with is my chocolate brownie in a mug. Now I've done a video on how to make this, so I'll link it down below. But basically I just found it on Pinterest. It's a brownie that takes two minutes in the microwave to make and probably like a minute maybe mixing up all the ingredients. And yeah, serve it with ice cream and icing sugar taste so good okay and the next couple of food items are actually biscuits and they are biscuits that I have been loving my whole life but we've just had them more recently and those are these ones here so just mint slices and these chocolate sandwiches which are also the same as chit chats so so good so yeah okay the next category is movies and there are a few that I have been loving and um, with all of the movies that I will mention I will leave the trailers in the description box below so that you guys can go and watch them if you would like to so the first one is The Devil Wears Prada next movie I have been loving is Frenemies and I okay and the next movie you guys are probably all gonna laugh at me but I really really love the Barbie movies and I watched a new one recently that I really really liked and it was called Barbie and Her Sisters and the Great Puppy Tale Okay, so the last category I'm going to do is music, and with all of the music that I'm about to mention, I will leave links in the description box below for you guys to go and listen to them if you would like to. But the first music item that I have been loving is Claudia Salewski's Summer 16 playlist on Spotify. While you're on Spotify, make sure that you go and follow me. My Spotify is pay2pay-nz, um, and also go and follow um, Claudia Salewski as well. So some of my favourite songs on there are Cool Girl by Toe of Low, Gold by Kaboo, Smoke and Retribution by Flume, Innocence by Flume, I Love LA by Young and Divine, Heathens by 21 Pilots, This Could Be Us by Ray Strimmerd, Inner Bloom by Rufus, Sex by Cheat Codes, Crazy by Kalani, Drugs by Eden, the Lay Me Down Flume Remix by Sam Smith and Flume. I'll Be Your Reason by Elenium. The Great Divide by Rebecca Black. Close to the Chainsmokers. 
Lauren by What's So Not, Layla by Club Kuru, Wake Up by Chelsea Cutler. If you're after a new playlist, then please go and check that one out because Claudia has like the best music taste out of anyone that I know. So yeah, all the songs on there are really, really good and I genuinely enjoy all of the songs on that playlist. But yeah, those ones are just my favourites. Okay, the next song that I have really, really been loving is Perfect Strangers by Jonas Blue. But everyone's heard this, but if you haven't... Okay, so the next song that I have currently been loving is Hurt So Good by Astrid S. The next song I have really, really been loving at the moment is that Bang Them Sticks by Megan Trainer. Um, the next song I have really, really been loving is In My Blood by The Veronicas. And the next song I have really, really been loving is Starving by Hayley Stainfeld. So yeah, if you just listen to the lyrics in that song, I actually really, really like them and they're all just really, really cute. Okay, the next song I have been loving is Side to Side by Ariana Grande and featuring Nicki Minaj. And the last song that I have been loving is Thumbs by Sabrina Carpenter. watched my last favorites video where I talked about Sabrina Carpenter and her music you will notice that this one is a very very different sound from her so it's more like upbeat bassy and I just love the lyrics in it because they're all so true yeah like I mentioned before um, at the start of this music section that all of these songs that I have played to you or mentioned will be listed in the description box and there we go guys that is all of my favorites I really really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys liked this video and you would like to see more videos from me then please give this video a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already 
If you are new, then I just want to say hey and welcome to my channel. And I hope you decide to stick around and join our family here on this channel. Please check out some of my social media links that I have listed in the description box below. And hit me up on them and give me a follow. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Really, really loving. Oh, my nose is really itchy. So this is, oh, you can see my size. <laughs> this month, not this month. I always say that in one of my favourites. I'm like, this month I've been loving, but I don't do monthly favourites. Moody pink. And you push, and you push. Rachel what? Rachel watch. Because you, and that's, uh, bleh. On Spotify, make sure. Spotify. I've currently been lo Ooh, let's drop the phone. Once Ed finishes. Okay. Ow, just scratched myself.